You're watching CT Live on NBC Connecticut. Welcome back. We know the holidays are getting close. Everybody wants to have some of that pumpkin pie, but we're here to tell you how to make smart choices around the holidays. Dr. Eric Kusher is here. Well, thank you for having us today. Oh, it's my pleasure. So what do people do? We all want to run for those sweets, uh, but how do we make smart choices? Yeah, holidays can be sometimes a little difficult to navigate. Um, a couple of things that you have to remember is food's going to be everywhere. Mm -hmm. So it's don't focus so much on the amount of food that you have because you're going to be eating more than usual. But try to stay focused more on the types of foods that you're eating. So if you want to go for the turkey, if you want to go for the vegetables, if you want to go for the cranberry sauce, those are probably the best choices mm -hmm. because they have the least impact on your blood sugar and your ability to burn fat. The other thing that I could say is, you know, Thanksgiving is one day. Christmas is one day. So celebrate on that day. If you have family over, don't put the leftovers back in your refrigerator. Don't give do them, it. Give them, take it on the road. <laughs> um, because that doesn't have to turn into a week of gluttony. It can be a one day celebration. Um, try to keep your workout schedule as close to regular as possible. And maybe most of all, don't freak out if you gain a couple of pounds. Mm -hmm. Because on the program, if you gain a couple of pounds, you can get right back on the program as soon as the holiday's over. Take that weight off right away and continue down the path if you're gonna continue losing weight. Now with the folks that you're creating plans for here, is that something, especially around the holidays, that you try to educate them about in terms of when they're shopping and, and getting ready? Absolutely, we don't do that just on the holidays. We actually do that year round mm -hmm. because sure there's gonna be a holiday season, but people also go on vacations, they have weddings, they have events. You have to learn how to navigate these things. We need to make sure that they are gonna be speed bumps in the process at worst, and they're not gonna sabotage the patient's long-term progress. So if you go out to a restaurant or to an event, you can actually follow the guidelines of the program when you're sitting at a table, as long as it's someplace where somebody is serving you. So you ask your server to have the kitchen prepare your food that you, the way that you want it to, grilled and, and, and baked instead of fried and deep fried. Um, vegetables steamed, the, every restaurant will do it for you now and you can stay pretty close to plan. You lose a little bit of control but you can maintain at least. Um, if you want to have a drink, there are choices to make. You know, alcohol is going to get metabolized just like sugar so it's mm -hmm. going to be counterproductive but you can go to clear liquors, vodka, gin, tequila in place of wine or beer. Mm -hmm. That way you don't get the fruit juice and the grain and the alcohol is a double whammy and that's gonna have the least impact. So navigate these things to the point where you're gonna do the least damage to yourself so you'll have the least ground to recover when you get back to your home ground. And we have patients that come in here and they're on insulin, they're on medications for blood pressure, their cholesterol's high. In a matter of weeks, we get them off their medications with their doctor's help. Um, we watch the appearance change, and at the end of the day, it's a transformation that's just so rewarding to me and the staff, just like it is to the patient. And it's a physical transformation as well, but also emotional too. Emotional and mental. I mean, we see patients come in here on the first day at a weight they don't want to be at, mm -hmm. their face shows it. They come in here six months later, 100 pounds down, and they're, they're different people. They just don't have a different body, but they have a different countenance about themselves. They're happier in their lives. Great things to remember, especially yes. around the holiday season. Yes, very important details.